both teams something of a tryout match. Both sides are hoping that the players that turn out tonight will show the potential and help to bring the countries near the top when the World Cup is played in England, the final that is in 1966. Now, Uruguay did very well in the World Cup in 1950 and 1954, but since that, they've gone somewhat into the background as a world power in soccer. Uh, they are hoping that they have now come to the stage where they're ready to build up to prominence once again. The Irish team, of course, at Swansea, for the first time without any of the old brigade, which did so well in Sweden, they beat Wales, and the selectors have voted confidence in them by naming the same team to play tonight. We have not, as this young team anyway, has not met continental opposition. Therefore, they're giving them the chance to see these type of opposition tonight, and from there on, we hope that uh, they'll go forward. One of the players about whom we know very little in Northern Ireland is George Best, the Manchester United boy from Craiger District of Belfast, who has done so well since he went into the team. George, tell me about yourself. Uh, well, I've always been interested in football since I was a youngster, and uh, the first I ever played was at Lisnashara School and uh, the school's teams, and I played for Craigie Boys Club, and uh, Manchester United scout seen me playing for Craigie and uh, invited me for trials with Manchester United. And uh, at first when I went over, I only stayed a couple of days, and I was homesick and came back home. But my father, he had a talk with Matt Busby, and uh, he decided to give me another chance. So I went back and uh, stayed since then. Did you ever play schools international? Uh, well, I think the, the Irish selectors thought it was a bit small. What age were you there? Uh, well, I was only about five foot three. And, and you're, uh, now, you're now 17 years old. What's your height and weight? Um, almost five foot eight and uh, nine stone eleven. Well, tell me, this is a busy week for you. What, what, what's the programme this week? Yes, uh, well, Saturday I finished the league programme with Manchester United at Old Trafford against Notts Forest. And uh, Monday night played in the final of the Youth Cup against Swindon at Swindon. I came straight here for tonight's match and play again tomorrow night in the second leg of the Youth Cup at Old Trafford. Have you played more matches then than the rest of the first team players, George? Yes, well, I've played all the, all the first team matches plus youth team games, mm. so I've played a few more. Have you felt any strain at all with this programme? Well, this last few weeks, it's I've been feeling it a bit, but I'm still enjoying my football. You know, I always enjoy it. Uh, I know a young fellow like you is very young to be giving you advice, but uh, what, from a point of view of incentive to other young boys in Belfast, can you give me some idea of your the earnings that can be made in football? Well, I've only been in the first team roughly about three months, and since then I've saved almost uh, about £700 pound in good. three months. Very good, isn't it? So I'm hoping to get a car soon. Well, the best of luck, George, to you tonight and to all the Irish boys here behind me. Okay.